Our digital world runs on powerful chips that produce a lot of heat, uh, around 50 times more concentrated than a barbecue. And this number is rising rapidly as we need more computing power for everything from machine learning to cloud computing. And this brings two big problems. So first of all, how to extract this heat and avoid that this heat extraction becomes a bottleneck for performance. And secondly, the cooling methods we use today have an enormous environmental impact. So a data center right now on average spends around 30% of all their electricity on cooling, which on a global scale is more than all the people in New York and London combined. So it's clear that we need um, new data center cooling technologies that are more effective and more sustainable. I'm Remco, the CEO of Corinthus, a EPFL startup here in Lausanne that I co-founded together with my colleague. I'm Sam, co-founder and CMO of Corinthus, and together with the team, we work on cooling technologies for next generation sustainable data centers. We use silicon microfluidics for the cooling of chips, which means we use uh, liquid cooling at the micro scale directly inside the silicon chip. Many cooling solutions today have uh, the heat source, the heat being produced inside the chip, and then this heat has to travel through many layers and interfaces before it's finally leaving the chip. And we try to go directly to the core, and we try to integrate very small channels that are tailored to the way how the chip is designed. So bringing the right amount of liquid to the right location to extract the heat right at the core. Next steps in our development is to work closely with chip designers, hardware integrators and data center operators to develop the technology and make sure it's market ready and that we can make a real impact in the cooling of data centers. The experience of VentureKick was, was, was absolutely great. We learned a lot in terms of uh, communicating our message, how to build up our uh, ideas around the, the business case. And it has been an, an, a continuous source of support for us that we could always count on. So it was a great experience. Today a data center is seen as something that consumes energy. But I think that with the effective cooling of data centers and reusing the heat that comes out of the data center, for example for heating up neighborhoods and, and buildings, we can turn the data center from something wasteful into an intermediate step in our energy system to transform it into a key part of sustainability. So I would advise not to try to do everything yourself. It's very tempting to work until you think something is ready, but I think building up a team around it uh, with the right people to accelerate market entry, that would be my number one advice. And I'd recommend trying to get as much early feedback from key stakeholders at your target customers as soon as possible to help guide your technical development.